The hits just keep on coming for Kanye, because in addition to losing his billion-dollar partnership, his agent, and his lawyer, his anti-Semitic rants are now affecting some teenagers who go to his uh, Donda Academy. The Donda Academy has been booted from a series of tournaments that are being played around the country. The tournament organizers have booted them and said that the things that he is saying just don't align with our uh, values. And sadly, these aren't the only kids who could be seriously affected by Kanye's blatant bigotry. There's a possibility he could lose custody of his kids. Even if Kim doesn't want to go into court and ask for him to lose custody, a judge could a family court judge. The North Star for a family court is best interest of the kids. That's what, that's the standard they use. Kanye's anti-Semitic sentiments could definitely be an issue because even though the divorce has been granted, they still have custody and property settlement that's on the table. And there's a trial for these two things in December if they can't reach a settlement. And right now, he doesn't even have a lawyer. And so the idea of reaching a settlement, especially the fact that Kim is certainly not happy with him, is remote. Yeah, if she raises this issue in court, how could a judge possibly look at the, the situation and say Kanye should have shared custody? In the meantime, the players from Donta Academy are just the latest victims of Kanye's horrible remarks, which particularly sucks because... These tournaments are really important for these kids to showcase skills to get into a college. I mean, ban Kanye from going to the tournament, that's fine. You don't want him to show up and make a spectacle. Don't take it out on the kids. Let the kids play. One thing's for sure, Kanye's hate speech is affecting far more people than just himself.